This is just a small video regarding my new foldable H copter. Uh, some of you saw my last video called the gimbal dance where I was just testing the GoPro gimbal you can see up in front. And I built this copter because I wanted to make some improvements regarding my old machine which I used pretty much in the last year. And I saw that I have to uh, change some things to get even better shots. Uh, for example, uh, when you're flying with a standard X-copter, very fast forward flight, you will always see the props in your field of view, which I really didn't like, especially when you're going fast. So I decided to build an H-frame, where I can put the gimbal all up front. And even when pushing it, you never see the props in your video footage, which is really great. Um, further, this one does even fold up to a much more compact unit than the old one, which was foldable too. So I need even less space than before. You can even detach the landing gear with one screw. So it's really compact. Um, the whole thing is even 30 km per hour faster than the frame you saw like one minute ago. Uh, I accomplished that by uh, choosing another motor and prop combination and I further tried to build the frame in a really slick manner so it cuts through the air. And I think I was successful with this. Um, I can explain further how the frame is built uh, on, on the belly. It's like the backbone of the copter, it's a carbon fiber tube with a diameter of 25 millimeters. Uh, in the front and in the back, the white pieces you see here are pieces made of 4 millimeter alloy. They attach to the carbon fiber tube and the alloy arms, which hold the motors, attach to the alloy plate, to the white part you see. It's really the hardest part to create. I used the jigsaw, but it wasn't that much fun. But finally I was able to manage it. Um, I'm using a NASA version 2 on this frame. Uh, we have two 4000 milliampere light poles in the back. Uh, the ESCs are hidden under this cover. Um, the copter uses uh, 4225 multi-star motors from Ternogy uh, with 610 kV. Um, at the moment I'm using 13 to 6 by 5 inch props, but I have to change it to 13 to 8 inch props, so I can really uh, accomplish uh, high speed with this thing, which was the main purpose of this build. Uh, last year I was filming some racing cars with this frame, and I uh, really recognized that 45 km per hour isn't that fast, when filming a racing car that is going around the track. So this machine uh, had to be significantly faster and I think I was able to accomplish that. Uh, this frame is like 70 km per hour fast. Uh, so you can even fly up in higher wind speeds than with the old version. Um, the all up rate of this frame is 2.8 kilograms. Uh, we have like four ESCs, the four engines, the frame, the props, the gimbal, video downlink, uh, and telemetry downlink from the NASA, and yeah, I really like this piece. So if you have further questions, just post a comment. If you like the information I gave you, just give me a thumbs up.